the anatomy and physiology of the respiratory system. So the respiratory system, its function is to take in oxygen, to oxygenate our blood and our organs, and release carbon dioxide. This oxygen provides energy for the cells in our body. And this is accomplished through gas exchange. So the gas exchange process, this is automatic. When you're breathing, you're not thinking about it, you just automatically breathe. The air comes through your nasal cavity into the pharynx, which is the area like in the back of your throat, down through the larynx, which is your neck, and the larynx is where your vocal cord is. Then it comes down through your trachea. In your trachea, there's something called the epiglottis. This is a flap that solid food and liquid don't go into your lungs. So this epiglottis kind of protects the lungs when you, you're eating or drinking. So the trachea branches off into two bronchii into the lungs, which then branch out into narrower sections called bronchioles. So it goes even narrower into bronchioles. And then at the end of the bronchioles are little sacs called alveoli, and they look like little grapes. They're just like little circles. When a person inhales, these alveoli inflate and, and then deflate. They're like little balloons on the ends. This is, the alveoli are the main site of gas exchange. Important to know that. The gas exchange process takes place between the alveoli and the blood. In these alveoli, there's surfactant and that allows the alveoli to inflate by lowering surface tension. The surfactant reduces the pressure required to inflate the alveoli. And then oxygen passes through the alveoli wall into surrounding blood capillaries. So there's like these little balloons at the end, the alveoli, and there's little blood capillaries all around them. And when it passes through those capillaries, the oxygen is then grabbed by the red blood cells. When a person exhales, this whole process is reversed. Carbon dioxide goes into the alveoli, up through the bronchioles, up through the bronchii, up through the trachea, up through the larynx, up through the pharynx, and then out your nose through your mouth. <laughs> your diaphragm flattens to bring air in, and it expands to push the air out. Okay, and that's it for the respiratory system. If you want that free 14 page ATI study guide, make sure to grab one down below. If you want the full ATI T's science study guide, you can go ahead and click that link below as well and it will bring you over to where you can purchase. Okay, thanks guys.